Hello, my name is Krista, and I'm going to lead you on a tour of one of Pickerington Public Library's very useful resources called Transparent Languages. It's a wonderful language learning tool. It offers courses in 106 different languages, some of them with multiple dialects available to learn about. You probably already got to this site through Pickerington Public Library's eBranch resource page. But just to make sure, in case you access this video um, through social media, just to show you how to get back to all of these sites, um, I just want to show you the path, pickeringtonpubliclibrary.org, and then you select eBranch. And that takes you to a lot of the current videos that we've been creating um, to help learning continue at home, as well as some eBranch resources that we already had in place, which are fantastic. They're listed in alphabetical order, and we're going to go down to T for transparent language, and then you would select view. Now, once you're there, uh, you'll be taken to a home screen. It will ask you for your Pickerington Public Library card number, which is found on the back of your card. And the first time you get into this program, it will actually have you set up a username and password. Um, that knows that will allow the program to know it's you, and it will help you pick up where you left off with each language. So the screen you're seeing now is all of the languages that there are to study. Um, perhaps you have found yourself with a lot more free time and you thought, hey, let me go brush up on whatever language I used to know from school. Or maybe you want to try a completely new language that you've never tried before. Um, perhaps you are helping a student at home complete some foreign language assignments. Um, whatever the case, um, it's a great learning tool and allows you to really explore whatever language it is. I'm going to choose French. There's different dialects, Moroccan, Canadian. I'm just going to choose this one and continue on the learning path that I've started. Vous cherchez. So as you can hear, it will say a word. This is just one of the exercises you can do. Um, you hear the the voice say it, and then if you press on turtle, it'll play it more slowly for you. Okay, so I'm going to type in Okay, um, one thing one thing to note um, is these little accent marks. If you are ever in the position where you're typing the French portion, for example, accent marks matter in which direction they're pointing. De l'eau, s'il vous plaît. I'm going to leave this up so you can see what it is. You can do just a regular E and the E's with the different kinds of oxendegu, oxendegu, okay. Here we go. It's a whole sentence, so make sure you show that as well. Trouver. Ne pas. Oops. Je ne parle pas. I typed in M-O-T, so it will count that wrong. Merci. Mademoiselle. L'adresse. Au revoir. Pardon, mademoiselle. Parler français. Ok. Yeah. Vous parlez français. Ok, so now it's, it's wanting me to type the word that's missing here. So in the text box, here's the tricky part. I know that the C has that little 
squiggly thing on it. I got him. I forget what it's called. Vous êtes perdu? Une minute, mademoiselle. Je dois trouver un numéro. Je suis américaine. Je cherche un hôtel. Vous parlez anglais? Un café, s'il vous plaît. Hang on, I need that little thing over the eye. Here we go. Bonjour, monsieur. Merci, madame. Okay, and then it wants me to read. M Monsieur Dagard says, pardon, mademoiselle. And mademoiselle Mignon says, oui, monsieur, vous êtes perdu? And Monsieur Dagard said, no, no, je ne suis pas perdu, je cherche la sortie. And mademoiselle Mignon says, la sortie, vous cherchez la sortie? And Monsieur Dar Dargard says, oui, s'il vous plaît. Je dois trouver un taxi. So basically, he's talking to a young woman. She asks him if he's lost. Is he lost? No, he's looking for the exit. Does he find a taxi? No, he must find one. Hit submit. Okay. I'm going to get out of here because this is going to continue on with the test. I don't, I don't want to bore you too much. I don't know how much is left with, how much is left with this one. But I wanted you to get an idea of what those look like. Um, everything's divided into units. So you have one unit that's all about um, learning to say hello and greeting one another, uh, making plans, organizing a trip. Wouldn't that be nice? Eating out, some things we haven't been able to do for a while. Um, pleased to meet you, getting around the city and dealing with money and out and about. Um, so as you progress through all the lessons, uh, you can take the test and see how you do. The first test that I took, I only got a 49% and then a 69 and then a 74. Um, every little way you pronounce things and every little accent mark counts. So it's really good at making sure you're exact in learning the language. Um, you can do the listening, reading, speaking, or writing. Um, again, make sure you've got a microphone working for the speaking ones. Um, um, you can basically do, you know, unscramble, you can listen, you can do matching. Here's how the matching looks. Let's just do some basic vocabulary. Let's say we're just doing, we've got numbers. How old are you at school? Let's do practice being at school. He wants to use the microphone. Let's see if it knows. Testing one, two, three. Okay, it recognized my microphone and it's gonna let me go ahead. So um, we're gonna read an item. And then we're going to either say it or drag it to match it. So let's try one of these. I don't like, um, that would be this one. And we can see what it sounds like. Je n'aime pas. Okay. Je n'aime pas. I don't like that. French. Le français. Art. L'art. I like. J'aime. J'aime. And science. La science. La science. Okay. So that is what one of the matching activities looks like. 
So have fun playing around with this. I hope you enjoy exploring and maybe you, you'll even decide to check out more than one language. Um, as you know, language learning tools can be very expensive to purchase on your own, but this one's free to you as a Pickerington Public Library card holder. So have fun and thanks for joining me today.